Well, first of all, it's a very interesting um, event every year. In any case, um, I've gone to the one in Bratislava. This is the first time I come here to the Tatras. Um, very well attended, very interesting participants. But also this year, besides the four countries that are uh, typically uh, participating, you had the ministers of finance of Germany and you, you had the minister of finance of France. Uh, you also had uh, Austria participating. And we were talking specifically, and I say we because I was asked to join them in their own conversations, uh, about a, a digital taxation, which is a very complex issue. It's being discussed a lot in many uh, uh, in many uh, areas, in many quarters. Um, that was very important. The emphasis on digital, the consequences of uh, the progress on digital, on artificial intelligence, blockchain, the cloud, uh, big data. How do you deal with that in terms of development? How do you deal with that in terms of leapfrogging, uh, you know, shortening the periods for progress? Uh, and at the same time, how do you apply that to education in particular? Or how do you apply that to health in particular? How do you apply that to taxes in particular? How do you apply that to research and development in uh, technology itself? Because technology does not have to be just digital. You know, you're talking about how do you produce. Even, even in agriculture, you have to introduce uh, the better uh, ways, the better uh, technologies. So that part was also very important. And then the concern about the men and the women involved, which means how does this digital affect the world of work, the future of work, the people who may be displaced by technological progress or the people who may be disrupted by technological progress. So that's uh, another angle. Um, and then, last but not least, I would say, to discuss the issues of the region, um, the growth, the inflation, the public finances, the deficits, etc., but also um, less uh, less general things, that very more specific, like migration, for example, which are uh, complex issues, which sometimes have proven uh, rather divisive.